Hi, and welcome to English 8. I am Mrs. Kelly. wanted to give you a little background about myself. I have a journalism degree from Indiana University. I was a journalist for 15 years before going back to school to become an educator. I have been teaching in the county for nine years. I see some familiar faces from Ken Colbert and then um, worked at Trailside Middle School in Ashburn. I do have three children um, in the county schools. One is here at Blue Ridge and two are at uh, Loudoun Valley. And two things I love to do, riding my bike and walking my dog. So if you see me out and about Percival, I'm happy for a honk and a wave. You will start receiving one and only one email from me um, on a weekly basis, and that will be Friday evenings or Sunday evenings, and it's just a look ahead at the week um, that's coming. Email is the best way to reach me. I will respond within one business day. Uh, I do work from Blue Ridge from our classroom, and I'm happy to receive a phone call between 8 and 4 uh, when I'm not teaching. Uh, and I will return that call as soon as I can. Uh, I do have a website that you can use as well as your students um, and that keeps them um, understanding the assignments that they have for class. This is what their Schoology page looks like when they log in. Uh, they have a link for their Google Meet. They have a link for office hours on Mondays. They have a link to look at book reviews and then they have a link to um, email me. When they click on class agenda, it will bring them to this website. And this website is updated daily. And so uh, currently it is week two, September 14th through 18th. And below this, there will be a short two minute video, just a recap of our day. And then there is a to-do list. And so uh, usually these things are accomplished in class and in learning lab. Um, it's very rare for students um, to have homework in English 8. Schoology is our primary resource for students uh, completing work and turning in assignments. Uh, I did include a video on my welcome page if you're interested in learning more about Schoology. Um, it is a very large program. It is a wealth of knowledge, and we are all going to continue to grow into it um, as the school year progresses. Our course outline. Uh, students will work on literary analysis, they will use whole class texts, they will use independent selections, and they will also use club uh, book club selections. We do quite a bit of writing in English 8. Uh, they will develop and complete self-selected pieces across genres with uh, my support. Oral communication, the students will participate and develop formal and informal discussions and presentations, including Socratic seminars. Along with our writing, we do quite a bit of editing and grammar, so students will learn and review skills through mini lessons and individual conferences. And students will research using the internet, um, and they will do, learn to do this effectively and ethically. And then vocabulary. Uh, students will develop word skills through studying roots and focusing on Latin and Greek word uh, content expectations. Uh, students are to read for 30 minutes daily. Uh, I'm really asking your students to advocate for themselves this year, that they come and ask questions. Uh, there are multiple ways for them to ask for help. They can always email and I will respond. They can, uh, after class, they can stick around for Learning Lab and they can ask questions there. And then, um, as I mentioned, there are uh, office hours on Mondays from 10.30 to 11, and they can um, meet both myself and Mr. Kurzman with any questions that they have. Uh, and then I just ask for students to have a growth mindset, and they have. Your students are doing so well. Instructional strategies. Uh, middle school English is based off of reading and writing workshop models. Uh, we will work asynchronous, asynchronously on Mondays, and um, Mondays typically are time for reading and then writing in their reading journals. And then as you've seen, students participate in synchronous learning Tuesday through Friday on an AABB schedule. Uh, during our Google Meets, uh, students are communicating, they're collaborating, they're thinking critically and creatively. Um, and then during Learning Lab, students work on their own refining skills that they learned in class. 
Um, at any time, as I mentioned, students are able to return or stay in our learning lab um, to ask get questions, get clarification, um, or even if they um, would like something read aloud, uh, I can do that as well. Um, expectations to arrive to class on time, and I know that depends on Wi-Fi. Uh, if your student is having trouble uh, staying in the meet or even just joining the meet, um, please have them email as soon as they can. Um, and then they can also try again in a few minutes. Um, if a student is continuing to have struggles, um, I would just ask them to leave the meet and to go to Schoology and see the assignment for the day. I do expect participation in class, um, and that can be with discussion in the chat, raising their hand, and then in small groups. Uh, we do a lot of work during class, and then we do work during learning lab, and so I ask that students complete the as assignments during that time period. And I just ask that they're positive, respectful, and helpful, and they have been more than that. So I really appreciate um, your students greatly. Two types of assessment in English 8. We have formative, which is not graded. Um, it is a knowledge check, and it's when a student and myself can see um, where the student should go from there, and then um, if where, uh, how should they grow from that assignment. And then uh, we do have summative assignments, and they are graded, and they assess uh, the knowledge. And lastly, our climate and culture. Um, last week was not perfect by far, uh, but as I mentioned, your students were absolutely amazing. I appreciate their patience, uh, their kindness, and I so appreciate their knowledge of technology and their help. Um, it's very important to me that I get to know your students, and so um, I know those relationships will continue to grow uh, in the coming weeks. If there's any way I can help your student, um, please reach out. I'm happy to help with English. I'm happy to help with anything middle school related. And as your students are well aware, um, our motto this year is that we are not going to stress over things we cannot control. I am looking forward to a really great year. Thank you.